Can we do thank you? Should we do that comment? Mrs. Healy was really the first person who sparked um, a passion for writing. When I first came to Dwight Englewood, I knew what a special place it was mm -hmm. because Carla Healy worked here. You have touched the lives of not only so many hundreds and hundreds of students, but so many women like myself. You are the embodiment of a woman, a mother, and a teacher. You are so kind, so patient, and we are all so lucky to have known you. We are going to miss you here, Carla. Things will never be the same. You are the Derek Jeter of the lower school because you look much too young to retire, but we know how hard you work and how consistently good you are. My first remem remembrance of uh, Carla Healy was when I was the, f the um, lower school principal for one year, uh, the year of the merger. This was uh, off campus on uh, Booth Avenue, and my office was directly across from her third grade classroom. Um, I spent a lot of time in, in Carla's room uh, asking her for advice and uh, getting lots of good guidance about uh, how to uh, be a good principal and to uh, help in that first year of the, you know, the merger. The kindergartners are so fortunate to have such a fabulous librarian as you. They enjoyed coming up to library time and seeing you and hearing you tell stories. And one thing in particular that my kids loved was getting bookmarks from you. I would like to share one experience I had. I was at a party in Nyack and I, I ran into the Forrester family who talked about how their son was so unhappy in public school and when he got transferred into your classroom, school became a whole different thing for him and he just loved your class and I wanted to share that with you and just, just you're just a great friend and I wish you the best of luck in everything you do. Third grade with Mrs. Healy was a very memorable time for me. Whether it was doing fractions with Hershey bars. To listening to me when I needed someone to talk to. She was always there by my side. I will always remember how exciting and fun you made learning, and I really appreciated that. Miss Healy was one of the best third grade teachers anyone could ask for. She inspired my love for poetry and writing. I so enjoyed working with you over the years. You always uh, brought class and style to our building, and as a librarian, my kids so enjoyed coming to you and the library. You always made it a warm, comforting environment. And Carla? I want to say thank you so much for always making me smile and making me feel so welcome and part of the family here at Dwight. Uh, you're going to be greatly missed. And although you're a Yankee fan, you're the nicest and kindest Yankee fan and person I have ever met. Carla, it has been a privilege to work with you for the past year. I am extremely grateful that I got to Dwight and Wood when I did because I got to work with you and meet you. Carla, you are truly a national treasure. You are a master teacher and you've been an inspiration to us all. I'm lucky to have you as a friend. I love you and wish you all the best. There are many teachers, students, parents who will miss Miss Healy and I'm sure she'll come back and visit us. Carla, you're the special teacher that every child remembers and the special colleague and friend that I'm lucky to have in my life. Thank you, Carla. Thank you, Mrs. Healy. Thank you, Carla. Thank you, Mrs. Healy. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Healy, for being such a great pen pal and friend. I could not have asked for a better third grade teacher. Thank you, Carla. Carla, thank you for all you've done, and I wish you so much luck in your life. Thank you. Thanks, Carla. Thanks for everything. We love you. Thank you, Carla. Thank you. Thank you, Carla. Thank you for being you.